Well, we've got fossils in this Damagene sandstone, this Eocene Age rock. And they should look a little bit familiar because there is a descendant living in San Francisco Bay today. They're called Teratella. They're little coiled marine snails. To get an idea of what the lay of the land looked like here 45, 50 million years ago, well, over where Black Diamond Mines Regional Preserve is, the Antioch foothills, that was swamps and lagoons. But by the time you got to where Rock City is, you were already in deep ocean basins. The ocean floor fell away quite rapidly. So you have this granitic sand being carried by rivers from east to west. The stuff that's dumped at where Black Diamond is, very shallow, and you had algae growing, which died and became peat and was buried and to eventually become that coal for the Mount Diablo coal fields. Over here, coal never formed just because it was deep water and not shallow lagoons. And these little teratella, well, they're actually shallow water critters. They lived over where Black Diamond is today, but after they died, their shells were swept by currents down into deep ocean basins. Now head down the stairs to the dirt road below. Turn right and head uphill on the Wallpoint Road for a minute or two. Turn left at the sign that says Rock City Trail to Madrone Canyon Trail. After a couple of minutes on the Rock City Trail, you'll reach stop 2.5, a sign marking the turnoff to Sentinel Rock 